Today, I'm gonna show you what to do if you cut a baseboard, a piece of crown molding, or even a regular piece of wood just a little too short, maybe an eighth of an inch to a quarter of an inch. I'm gonna show you how you can repair it, sand it down, and paint it, and save yourself a trip to the lumber yard and save a little bit of money and time. As you can see here, I have two small pieces of pine, and this is gonna do two things. The first thing it's gonna do is help keep the board straight. So they'll be aligned, and it's also gonna be a hard barrier to mold my form. So when I put the super glue and baking soda, it's gonna catch the form of the board on the outside. When you mix super glue and baking soda together, something really interesting happens. It gets hot, and that's because the two ingredients start to work together very quickly. It's like fast forwarding a movie. We call this an exothermic reaction. The baking soda helps the super glue work faster and harder than usual. It's just like a coach pushing an athlete to their limits. This makes the final bond much stronger than super glue on its own making it a great option for tough jobs. As you can see, I have all my bracing and tape off of this piece of wood and I'm turning it over and I'm patching up any holes that was missed earlier. I'm trying to be as careful as possible not to make a big clump of hard super glue and baking soda that I have to sand down afterwards. If y'all are interested in purchasing this glue that I'm using in this video, in the video description I'll have the website It'll be an active link you can click, and I'll also have a discount code that's linked to me. Thank y'all for watching. Y'all are the best. I tell everybody who asks me, how is my channel doing? I tell them it's awesome because I have the best audience in the world. Thank y'all for watching. Y'all have an awesome day and enjoy the rest of the video.